Welcome back, third grade scientists. Today, we are going to review the stages in the life cycle of a plant. And I'm gonna remind you and lead you to another video that I created where you can actually work on an experiment to study these stages in real time. So let's get going. Okay, so stage one of the, of the life of a plant is called the seed stage. The life of most plants all start with a seed. Seeds are a small plant covered with a protective skin called a seed coat. The seed coat will keep it safe from the weather. What do seeds need to grow? Yes, they need water, soil, sunlight, and space. Seeds come in lots of sizes. Most are small, but the biggest seed is called the coco de mer. It is the seed of a palm tree and can grow to be 12 inches long, which is pretty big. That's this big. That's a pretty big seed and it can weigh up to 40 pounds. That's about as heavy as a microwave. Can you believe it? The second stage is called the germination stage. So we all know it's important to water a seed. Well, as water is taken in, the seed begins to swell and fill up. It gets bigger and bigger. This is the part of a plant's life cycle called germination. It means the plant is now beginning to grow. Pretty neat, huh? Soon, a tiny part of the plant will poke through. Can you believe that this little guy poking out of the seed will soon become a full adult plant full of flowers? Stage three is called the seedling stage. Soon after this, roots will start to grow down in the soil. The roots will hold the plant up nice and tall and a sprout will grow up into the air. See the sprout in the picture? Its sprout needs food. It uses the sunlight, water, air, and space to grow. This little plant is called a seedling. Seedlings are small and thin and usually only have a few leaves. It may be small, but this little thing will be a plant before you know it. All these trees you see in this picture all started as a small seedling. Stage four is called the young adult stage. The seedling is now growing bigger and soon it turns into a young adult. At this stage of life, the roots of the plant go down and start to spread out into the soil. It does this because the plant needs more support now that it is bigger and growing to be much bigger. The stem grows stronger, taller, and thicker. The leaves on the plant begin to get bigger too. There are much more of them now. Can you count how many are on this young adult plant in the picture? Finally, stage five is the grown adult stage, the last stage. Finally, when the plant stops to grow, it has become a grown adult. Adult plants can grow flowers. These flowers will have their own tiny seeds inside of them. The tiny seeds will grow to be the same kinds of plants as its parent. Animals and insects will spread these seeds as they are eating from the plant. The seeds begin to grow in a new place and we start the life cycle all over again. And just as a reminder, you can watch this process in action. Look for my video on the channel called Paper Plate STEM. In this video, I teach you how to make your very own greenhouse out of a paper plate. You'll use lima bean seeds, which when you soak them in water, you can start to see the stages develop. And when you hang this greenhouse in your window, you can watch these five stages happen in real time. Have fun, keep learning, keep exploring, and growing third grade scientists.